All right, I'm here with Devonte. A lot of Arkansas fans have seen his highlight video on the blog and on YouTube, and a lot of them compare him to Darren McFadden as far as size, speed, and running ability. What do you What do you think about that, Devonte? Um, uh, that's um, that's a great compliment, actually, because Darren McFadden is actually one of my favorite running backs in the NFL right now. I mean, it's it feels great to be compared to Darren McFadden. Because uh, him playing for Arkansas was you know, exciting because he had exciting games every every game. You know, so I enjoyed watching him every week that they were playing. What what are, what are you, the similarities you see with him and, and you? Um, power and speed. And he's uh, electrifying when he, when he when he breaks loose. Do you when you, when you run? You, some of the things that you do on the field just uh, it's kind of hard to describe. But, but do, do you sometimes go back and look and think, man, I can't believe I did that? Oh uh, yeah, when I watch my highlight video, man, it yeah, I don't know, it make me cause the chills, you know, it make me want to go back to football season, you know, cause it was exciting. And now since it's over right now, I definitely miss it. You know, you you've always said Arkansas is definitely up there with, at the. You know, highest level of interest with you. Why? Why do you like Arkansas so much, Devonte? Because uh, um, you know they got a, a great offense, a, a big offensive line. They got a good defense. You know, um, got a great, a good, a good coach. You, know? hey, you are you planning to make some visits during the spring and some of the different schools? And if you are, what what are some of the schools you're thinking about visiting? Um, like in Arkansas, uh, Tennessee. LSU and Tulsa. When you when you've seen Arkansas play on TV this year, what uh, what's some of the things that kind of stood out to you? Um, I, to be honest, it made me think about you know it made me think of early to, that I wanted to go to Arkansas, and especially in, when I seen the kind of comeback they made last night in the, in the Sugar Bowl against. Um, Ohio State. Against, yeah, against Ohio State. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, that, that, that was definitely a heartbreaking loss. But uh, just kind of talk about what you're going to be looking for in a school. For what's going to determine your future, you know, uh, destination for a college? Um, academics, really. Got it, because school comes first before sports. And that's how was, that's how I was raised. What what about the pro style offense that Arkansas runs? Uh, a lot of people say that obviously gets. Uh, guys ready for the league because that's what the that's what you're going to see in the NFL. Like, what, is that um, an attractive uh, you know thing for you? Yes, sir. I, um, the running back um, now Davis. Yeah, um, watching him play with the kind of with the kind of running game they got, it's, it's, it's crazy. I mean, because I never seen a running back make them kind of runs with the kind of speed that he has. Let's get to know uh, Devontae. What's your uh, what's your favorite meal? Um, I eat rice and gravy. That's that's been that's been. <laughs> what's your uh, what's your favorite uh, movie? Um, to be honest, I don't really watch movies too much. I watch ESPN. Okay. What uh, what's your favorite NFL team? Uh, right now it's uh, going with the Philadelphia Eagles. Favorite NFL player? Um. Maurice Jones Drew, running back from um, Jacksonville, Jaguars. Uh, who who is the most beautiful woman in the world? <laughs> Megan Good. Uh, all right, I'm here with uh, Devontae's dad, and and you and you and Devontae both have a you know a fondness for Darren McFadden. When when did that start for you? Uh, I could say from the first moment I seen Darren McFadden, I knew he was going to be a special player. What, uh, what 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 impressed you the most about Darren? Power and the speed. Much like uh, Devontae, right? right? Yeah. When when at what point did you realize Devontae could be really something special? Uh, I would say when he was around seven or eight years old when he started playing pee wee football. You know, he was just more dominant than all the rest of the kids. And he also he, he also excelled in track and field right, yeah, too. Started, talk, kind of talk about that uh, if you want. Around eight or nine years old, he started running with a AAU team out of Baton Rouge and started.
started winning all kind of medals in track and stuff, you know, just and it, as he got old, he joined an AAU basketball team out of Lafayette and started playing that and winning back-to-back -back national championships in basketball in the AAU team. So that's when I knew he was special. What's it like seeing your son just, just his rushing totals just are insane sometimes for some, uh, some of his games. What's it like being uh, in the stands watching him run? Uh, it's exciting, you know, the last two years he played in Class 1A football and, you know, he put up, uh, like last year, he put up 1,700 yards and 36 touchdowns and he stepped into Class 3A this year and people said he wasn't going to do anything, you know, because, you know, he was used to 1A ball and he come here this year and put up 2,300 yards and 40 touchdowns, you know, so, you know, I just, summertime I put extra work on top of him along with what the coach is doing also, you know, so I just push him hard. Kind of talk about that work ethic. I mean, what, what, what that extra work, what does that entail? Uh, getting up 6 o'clock in the morning, hearing him crying, coming to the field, running, taking him to the gym, working out. After, you know, got to come back home, get ready, then go work out with the football team, you know. So, you know, there's a lot of work I put in with him. Coach, just kind of talk about the Devontae. What makes him such a great running back? You know, I think he has all the uh – what you're looking for in a running back. He has great vision, uh, sees the field, makes great cuts. Uh, north and south runner, I mean, he has great acceleration when he sees the, the, the opening, has good timing with the plays, and, um, and he's a tough kid. I mean, he, you know, he, you got you to really wrap up to, to tackle him. And uh, he's, uh, he's gotten better. I mean, he, he's, he's still a, a young running back, and I, I think he's got a lot of football in front of him. He's, he's a He's got all the things that you look for in a great running back. You coached at Mac McNeese State for a long time, and you've seen a lot of running backs. Where, where, would, where would he rank? Well, you know, he's right there up at the top. I and mean, we, we had some great running backs. I mean, I, I, I hate to start naming them because I, I hate to leave out any, but some of the guys around here that, that were uh, good running backs for us at McNeese were Buford Jordan, and, of course, Buford had a career in the NFL. Um, Tony Citizen was a young man that played at uh, Church Point High School that was a – Really, really good running back, uh, we and we had many more. But Devontae's right up there with the, you know that caliber of running back. I mean, and again, uh, and he's young and he has a, a lot of a, a bright future in in front of him.